Hi everyone, today I'll be going over creating a drop down menu. This feature allows you to organize your menu items in a neater way and allows for more space for your pages within your menu bar. How a drop down menu works is it allows you to hover over an item in the menu bar, say a category, and once hovered over, it will display all the clickable pages that you've set within that drop down menu item. It'll be easy to understand once I show you. So we can start here from our home page, and our first step to add a drop down is to head to the pages section of the sidebar. From here we can choose add page. And in the page category section, there should be a section called special pages. Choose menu drop down. And we can give this a name. So why don't we call this drop down and choose done. What this does is create an unclickable page in our menu. So now what we'll do is go back and choose pages again in the sidebar and choose add a page. And for this, we can just add a blank page. So how about we call this one blank page. Press done. Now you can see I have my drop down page and my blank page here in my menu. So to make this blank page part of my drop down page, I can go over to the pages section and I can click and drag this blank page underneath the drop down page and a little bit to the right. And you should see this little dotted border around the blank page. Then I can release. And now the blank page is part of the drop down menu. So we can go to the preview mode and I'll go back to the home page. And now if I hover over the drop down page, I can see blank page here and I can choose that. This feature would be great if you were, say, selling clothes on your website. You can create a drop-down item named Shop, and the pages Women, Men, and Children would be pages grouped under it that are clickable. It's more organized that way. And that's the drop-down menu in a nutshell. Play around with it, and I'm sure you'll get the hang of it. If you have any more questions, feel free to contact us. Thanks for watching.